10. We just put it real quickly in a spot in our yard to make sure we would be able to put this up. It's here where you can put your AC unit. It'll sit in there, you can put, on, on, there's one of these on each side. And, uh, or you can just open it up and let the air flow through there. Just put it up real quick. But we haven't even, as you can see, it's wrinkled, which means we haven't even stretched it out as far as it needs to go. I'm six foot, but look how much headroom that is. It's a lot of headroom. I'm hot right now, but in here, the airflow is really nice. So on a sunny day, yeah, you can take that top tarp off here, see? And it lets all that air come in here. So this is room one. We, of course, will have flooring in here and a tarp underneath. And it has compartments here to put things. And you can see in certain areas where you can slide your electrical stuff in. Um, this is the center room. It is high as well. As you can see how much head space there is here. There's a lot of room in there. This is going to be comfortable when we actually set it up properly. There's the bar there that we improperly, and it was my fault. I will admit that it was my fault. Um, so all those long bars should be fully extended before you start anywhere else. And once those are extended, this just pops up. So I can see how, what they mean. And then this is the last room, which I'm not going into because it's kind of dro drooping a little bit because we didn't extend that bar. And then there's another spot right there where you can put your AC unit. This tent, man, Let's see why they call it a cabin tent, man. Oh, I forgot, there's more, wow. Look at this, see this here? So there's more compartments to put things in. And then here, you can actually hook a light. The light can actually drop down to the center room. This is like massive, man. And it's not even fully up, but it is massive. This is what it, this is nice. And then there's the windows. There's a window there, window there. Window there, window there. So there are two windows per room. This is huge, isn't it? Yeah. A few weeks, in a couple, well, in a couple weeks, not even a few weeks. Two or three, Jason. Yeah, yeah, a few is three or more. So in a couple weeks, we'll be going here. 
Alrighty. Let's hop out. Kids in here? No, we can't play in here right now though because we have to take it down. Oh. I know. We just put it up to see how quick it'd be. So it is what they say. This tent will be a fast pop-up tent, <laughs> literally. You know, I I didn't even think about it. I remember thinking that we're gonna have to, you know, put these all together like we did our old tent, but you don't. They just simply, you know, push this here, extend out, click. That's how simple this tent is. So I'm going to say that on just putting it up alone, definitely get a tin. We have a few neighbors actually looking at it right now and it's not even fully up. So I'm sure when you take a uh, cabin tent like this and you put it up on a campsite, people stare at it maybe, I don't know. If my neighbors are, that means probably people at campsites will. This is something cool I noticed too. This is how simple it is. See that, it just dropped. And there you go, look, it's already lowered. That's how fast it is, how fast it goes up.